What is up guys, TFG the Forest Guy. I'm coming at you guys with a little bit of a different video today, guys. I wanted to talk a little bit about Hurricane Helene and the devastation that it has caused in Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, and especially in Asheville in the Western North Carolina area. Guys, my heart goes out to everyone who has been affected by this horrible, just downright horrible storm that has just decimated parts of Western North Carolina in the Asheville area, Banner Elk, Bryson City, Boone. I hope everybody that has been affected by this storm has been able to get out and is safe somewhere away from the floods. The rivers are, have been out of control. I've been seeing the devastation. I've been seeing the videos. I've been seeing the pictures. Both Pisgah and the Natahala National Forest are both have been decimated by this storm, which breaks my heart being a forest activist and someone who loves being in the outdoors to see the devastation that I have seen in Western North Carolina. It just absolutely breaks my heart because I've, I've spent so much time on that side of the state and it's my favorite side of the state to see it be decimated like it has been is just absolutely heartbreaking. I've also seen that the roads into Asheville and the surrounding areas have been completely cut off from basically everyone else. I-40 West, from what I was reading from Statesville, where I-77 is, has been shut down all the way in to Asheville through the mountains up near Tennessee. So I hear parts of I-40 have collapsed and have washed away from the river. And I, I just, I, I don't even know what to say, y'all. I mean, it, it, it's just, it, it's 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 hard to see that you know that the storm came up as far as it did because western north carolina got it the worst i have family i have my aunt and uncle who <clears throat> i was talking to yesterday who was telling me that trees were falling down in their yard and their neighbor's pool and sheds and everything have been just destroyed they're without power. They've been out without power, I think, for three days now. They're in the Spartanburg, South Carolina area, which was also decimated from the storm. My brother, who is a lineman, shouts out to you. Go do your thing. You guys are working around the clock. We 100% support you and everything that y'all do. I know you guys are working hard to get the power restored. They have linemen coming down from Canada, coming down 81, to help with the, the devastation in Western North Carolina and other parts. I've seen um, shots of Six Flags over Georgia down in Atlanta, completely underwater. It's just, I mean, this is the worst storm that we have had since, I would say, Hurricane Katrina, when Hurricane Katrina hit New Orleans in 2005. It was absolutely devastating, but this is just, it's, it's insane to see that the storm has come up as far as it did to the mountains. I've been uh, reading stuff about the U.S. Forest Service and the Park Services talking about the Blue Ridge Parkway has been shut down. Rocks and trees just fallen have decimated the parkway. I mean, it's just, it, it absolutely just breaks my heart, guys. But everyone who has been affected by this storm, I hope that you guys have found shelter and the people who have lost lives, because I know the death toll is going to be continuing to rise in the next several days to weeks as they continue to try to clean up this horrible mess that has been created by Hurricane Helene. And again, my hearts go out to everyone who has been affected by this storm and the people who have lost lives, people who have lost homes, power. I hear the gas stations, lines out, out, the, out to the street to get gas. Some gas stations are completely shut down, stores shut down. There's gonna be a lot of loss of food and I just, I mean, I, I don't, I don't know what to even say anymore of this. I mean, it's just, it's, it's just so horrible to see such a beautiful part of the state and that area, just even parts of Eastern Tennessee, Northern Georgia <clears throat> and Northern South Carolina, Western South Carolina and Western NC, especially just to see the devastation and just what it has brought is just absolutely horrible and a shame to see that that has happened. Guys, stay safe up there in the mountains. And everybody who has, has been able to get out, stay away. Do not go to Western North Carolina right now. If you're traveling that direction, avoid it at all cost. Any, any way that you can to stay away from Western North Carolina is the best thing right now as the cleanup crew tries to go in there and, and try to figure out this mess. But guys, 
that is the end of this video. It was a short little video. I want to talk about Hurricane Helene because I have family members that have been affected by this hurricane and my brother being a lineman being, and putting himself out there on the line to protect and help aid in any way that they can to help restore power to the parts of Western North Carolina and all over the state of South Carolina. Um, so I, that's why I want to come in here and, and bring this video to you guys because I have family and, and I have a brother who works as a lineman who is putting himself out there on the line and everyone out there, every rescue crew and the, the National Guard in Tennessee that has been helping to aid in the relief of Hurricane Helene. To all you guys, my, my hat's off. My hat's off to you guys. You guys are doing a wonderful job. Stay safe. And we are absolutely proud of the work and the hard work that you guys are doing to help keep us safe and the people of Western North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, and Florida. That's it, guys. This is TFG, the Force Guy, and I'll check back with you guys later.